Jesus wants to cook some ham. Jay, I can't even see the bottom of the pan. Located in the heart of Lancaster City sits Ebenezer Baptist Church. You got two pans of that? Where every Wednesday the pots are warm, the oven stuffed, and the smell of dinner fills the air in what's affectionately called Mama C's kitchen. Mama C is 94. And she's here, and she's here every Wednesday. Sandra Forbes started Mama C's as a way to help those in need in her community. I've been cooking for the homeless for 24 years. <laughs> it's named after the oldest member of her church. And I wanted to name something after her while she was living. Because everybody does stuff when people die. So why not do it while she's living so she can enjoy the legacy of it? I love you. I love you. I love you. I love you. Thank you for everything that you do. Member after member show up to cook, assemble. People are going to start coming in. We got to make sure we're ready. And pack up meals to serve to anyone who needs one. Did you want a meal? How many? One? And there's so many homeless people in Lancaster City and they don't have any food to eat. So this is a way to feed them and to let them know that somebody cares. The first thing she says before you can even tell her what you need, the first thing she says, what can I do for you? That's, that's just her. All of those are TLCs. I have one guy, I don't know who he is, he sends $20 a month. You know, to somebody that's not a lot, but that buys, that buys our styrofoam containers. Money is always tight, but Sandra never stops. We usually feed about 150, 180. Often digging in her own pocket to cover costs. I'm at grocery stores all the time, seeing who, what's on sale. Whatever's on sale, that's what I buy, and that's what we serve. We have one more box to go up to TLC. Fred, you got that one more box. As for what's next. If I had the money, I'd open a shelter of my own. It's my mission on life, to help somebody else. You know, the Bible says if I can help somebody as I travel along, then my living won't be in vain. You're welcome. So whatever I'm doing for somebody else makes me feel good. Lori Burkholder, WGAL News 8. Wow, impressive. Well, hot meals are given out Wednesday nights from 5 to 6. Sandra also runs a clothing bank at her church every other Friday.